Hey guys, it's Ram Morning, welcome back to more Pin Mario Fires in your door. Last time we uh found Professor Fackley, all up done. Hey hey man, what's up? Who's the high you got there with ya? What's up, babe? You wanna come out with us for a while? We'll play well nice. Man, what a fine looking good baby doing about turn set man to death. Oh, it's like so sweet, you voice think I'm cute, seriously. Yeah, guys, like you make me feel like totally bothering. Now get off my way. Ow, come on, I was cold. Are you too good for us? Come off, sister. Nobody says all this like that. <clears throat> Nobody. Let's go. Watch it. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, this kid. Uh, okay. A Goomba, a Spidey, Spidey Goomba, and a Power Goomba. Buy it whole. Goomba Valkyrie. The only one I should worry about is following my the spiny Goomba. See that spike on his head? Whoa, jumping at you, we don't want to take damage. And a power Goomba's airborne. Also, he's holding a dizzy doll. Uh, uh, sure. See so, ya. Yeah. So, pretty much what he's saying is spike equal don't jump, flying equal don't. Okay, so pretty much how this works spike equal don't jump, airborne equal jump. Uh, that's the dumbed down version. Pretty much means like you can't jump on, airborne, you can't handle them. So, anyway, uh, I won't be telling everything and because they suck. But anyway, yeah. Spiky Goombas do more damage than the uh, Wesley Ever Goombas, so, you know, get rid of that child first. And this douche is using the item. Ah, crap. No! I'm dizzy! Yeah, some enemies can hold the items when going into battle. I didn't know this fight could actually spawn that. That's the first time I've seen it. So this guy used a dizzy doll. Pretty much means your uh, chances of hitting him are now less. As you can see, my Mario is confused. But they're not always guaranteed to miss, though, so, you know, that's good. And things like this and Star effects immediately go away after the battle ends. Me, come on! <laughs> How later on lose it? That's an awesome. You ready, Mario? Yep. So yeah, you can have a first strike if you jump or hammer an enemy. Keep in mind the uh, spiky the elbow thing will st actually no. Here's the thing: you can't jump on a spiky enemy in the field, but you can hammer an airborne enemy while in the field, and you'll do damage to them. Weird. So anyway. Here we have another Goomba. Uh, past this point, um, if nothing spectacular happens like this battle right here, if the battle takes like a few seconds, yeah, I'll show it. But if nothing, it, pretty much I'm gonna, pretty much how random counts are gonna go, is if it's a new enemy or something interesting happens, I will show it. But if it's something pointless, like, but if it's an em if it's one of the enemies we've already seen, I will be showing it. If the battles take like five seconds, I will be showing it. But because, well, it's not really. No point in editing it out. Got a mushroom. Got another fire flower. And we are struck first. So yeah, at least they got like five seconds to do. And here we have. I will be showing required fights, so any fights you can't skip, I will be showing that. Anyway, these things you can hammer. Of course, a little bit of a slowdown, but a little bit of slowdown for like a second. Don't worry about it. If we go over here, go star piece. Let me see that thing. What the hell is that? Now, if we start jumping, oh, we get a thing pops out. That's a badge. And here we have a new enemy, a spin yet. These things have 3 HP, so you know, they're more doable than the Goombas. Even though they don't look it, they are. They still only have one attack power, so don't worry about it. And here we have the Pretty Lucky Badge. Causes enemies to miss sometimes when they attack Mario. So whenever Mario's attacked, the enemy has a chance of missing. That's a pretty good badge, all things considered. I just don't use it a whole lot. I'm more of attacking badges than uh, defensive badges. So yeah. So any, the stylish choice for the jump is pretty much a hit A while Mario was in the air. 
And for Gumbella, I didn't do it there, but... See, that's a pretty lucky badge. You can't super guard while that, while that happens, so, you know. You sort of can't do damage to them. See, Mario's like this. AA, AA. That's how you do all of it. Pretty much you're gonna have to do AA for the moves, but for starters, just AA, AA. <laughs> and get a heart. Hearts will store 1 HP, flowers will store 1 FP. Pretty simple. So you just all equip the bad jet, use BP. BP, not the gas, not the uh, oil company. And we get a black key. Uh, that will become a point in 32. Actually, about a minute from now. BP is pretty much your points for equipping badges. The more you have, the more badges you can equip. Some badges have like slots up to like 7. And those badges generally suck, but. Hey you! Yeah you, can you hear me? You can? That must mean you're the hero of legend! Not only the great hero of legend can hear my voice, yeah everyone else, nothing! See, long ago, it was for a castle curse of me looking in this bond. I was bummed. But I've been here ever since, waiting a long, long time for the hero to come by. Uh, you see, there's an infinite uh, food supply and an uh, infinite water supply here, so you know. No, it's pretty good, you know, sort of five-star luxury resort in here as well, but, you know. So, yeah, anyway, big guy. What, I, what brings here with you, like, a place like this? Oh, my, well, if you want to try to come we can trust this box. I figured maybe best not to mention we're looking for the crystal stars. Oh, right, I'll just sit it out loud. What's wrong with me? Oh, yeah, so for the crystal stars, are you now? There they are here. So, frankly, you can hear them. So, yeah, don't trust this ass. Don't trust this jerk. Well, you're definitely gonna need my help. You're gonna get those bad boys. So, first you do is look for the key lock box and use it to let me out. Definitely. By the way, the key looks like this. I can't show you since I'm in the box and. Um, I'm just assuming you can hear. I can, I'm just assuming you can see my text. My words as they form into a text and like a speech bubble. And we can do that. So, what do you think we ought to do, Mario? My uh, wife right, goes to find that key. Drops one here somewhere. Well, it's one to zero. You bought the key? That was like two seconds. Yes, thank. Ha! Thank nothing. <laughs> False. Ah, oh, crap. Did I eat the mushrooms again? Did I eat Luigi's poison mushrooms again? Oh boy, I did you fall for a burned you. You just got burned. Why do you think I think it was gonna help you? Yeah. Instead, I'm gonna spread a little of that suffering on join that stupid box. Yeah, sorry, but those are the breaks. I'm gonna cast an evil terrible curse upon you. But there, you cast. We enjoy that curse, sucker. You got what you deserved. We all about the sweet curse that just dropped. Well, listen well. From now on, if you press by certain errors, you turn into a paper airplane. <laughs> Trampling it. Some of your days on my terrible curse. <laughs> oh, I can't help but draw. You're doomed. This curse is pretty well, I guess. So I suppose I own it to you to explain it. Wait, you sat on everybody around like this one. The floor will start to glow. Yeah, okay, you're on the panel. Now press the try pressing Y. Then BAM! You'll be ready to play! Oh, the part is closed. You must do left or right to control yourself. I guess you got good at it. You might find a long way, but it's the only good thing. So be honest. This isn't this custom the worst thing that's ever happened to you. Yeah, uh, I get this terrible. <laughs> if you push me, you might turn to return to normal. Maybe. Wow, you foolish fool! <laughs> Nintendo should hire me as like the evil guy voice actor. Yeah, Cabela, that guy's insane. N Nintendo, I'll, I'll, I'll do voice acting. <laughs> I'll do voice acting. Uh, you sure? You don't, you don't want to voice the uh, next evil guy in the Mario Luigi series, which will have voice acting. Come on, Nintendo. Here we go out. I'm playing this game for free. I didn't have to play it. I didn't have to like it. Oh, Mario, come back. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Uh, side note, we found the door. <laughs> Not when you have one. It's the first year door spoke to more legends I can't believe is real. The legends are all true. There it is, big as life. Come on, let's move closer. 
Uh, you sure that's safe? Anyway, I believe there's a Starbeast here. If we look. Mm, no, I'm thinking of later. Actually, is that one here? Uh, what's up with that deal with that red pencil, huh? What do you think it could be, do you think? Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god! What's happening? Um, uh, good nerd! Explain her! What's going on? My name's Franklin! Don't you for... What are we talking about? Professor, what's going on? Um, uh, uh, my maps are starting to fly. Um, it's going up in the air. Uh, ah, I'm just trying to catch it. Damn it. God damn it. God damn it, Nintendo. Why'd you make my slide work? Try to make it like a look it. I'm trying to catch it. I'm going to grab it. Grab it. And here we have a, pla a flash of white. And we have the map. So what's going to happen? No, someone's drawing on the map. Looks to be a castle. No, I still have two payments left. Oh, I still have two payments left. The location of Crystal Sword Gordon in your magical map. Mario's learned a special move. You can now use Sweet Treat. Each time you get a Crystal Sword, you learn a new special move. Professor, the map! And what's before those crazy lights? Hmm! It appears that information where the course of science has appeared! And that shining light looks like his mysterious power is given to Mario. Well, one way or another, we shall return to my place and still need my policy. Hmm! Aha! I see! See what? I finally found my glasses! So where are you? glasses? Ah, that's good. You understand it, Professor? Yeah, I can read! I do a course to do. Firstly, about that light, we shall sing a Mario. By reckoning Mario can never form wise now, it's a special move. A special move? Yes, it is. Well, stuff like this is better explained by example rather than words. Would you like to try it out? Nah, sure. So we're going to, uh, uh, let's go outside. Well, this is the one, but this is the one tutorial in the game that's actually worth showing. So this pretty much gives you a pretty basic one idea how one down of how pretty much the some of the game's battle mechanics work. So we now we have star power. So that gauge not one power every day. That's a single unit of power. You see? Yep. So yeah. So whenever. You have a whole thing like that, yeah. you can use a special move. In this case, we can use Sweet Tweet. We have to repeatedly tilt left. We can actually do it. And you also see we have some prettier, uh, some colors of the crystal stars. Don't worry, there's not only three. There are seven, we're just getting quite like, three of them. The first three we're getting. And you see, now it's empty. Sweet Tweet is stored to HP and FP. Since you used one, one power, the other star base is now empty. See? It's empty! Even the gauge empties out now, you can still turn it up again. That's why the audience is watching your is so very important. See, so we have 11 people watching. If you get your audience excited, you can build up more star power. Let me show you what I mean. More power. Try to protect me, please. Nah, no, we can't see Frankie's HP. I'll just put on the screen where the stats are. Are you seeing them right now? Future me ended that in. No, you see that? You filled your audience, so they filled so many storage. Apparently, seeing a, a teenage girl beating up an old man of the same species, mind you, excites them. Jesus Christ, told the Oasis. Jesus, totes more sick than the floor. So anyway, let's do a jump on him. And you see, if I do stylish, the thing fills up more. Now let's keep building up the star power. As you see here, yeah, the numbers go up. So now it was 11, now it's 16. But more importantly, next to the side swipe uh, under the coins, you see two shine spots. Every time you attack, you get a bingo card. You get two of the same in a while. You uh, got them set. If you attack a third time, where well, you got two in a row, you get 
You get... You get a bingo slot. You get a bingo slot. So, match three of these and you win. Now this is set. You're going to get three science points no matter what. Three science points means... Okay, let me break it down. Three mushrooms gives you full HP. Three flowers gives you full FP. Three stars gives you uh, full... Pretty much fills your star gauge. Three science points, so it's all three. And maxes out your audience. And three poison mushrooms, yes, those are a thing. They will pretty much do half. All your audience will go and your HP, FP, and star power will be cut in half. So yeah, pretty much what he's saying is don't screw up the extra commands. And we have something here. <laughs> the bum. <laughs> See, he's gonna toss out of you. So pretty much you have to hit X whenever someone has something in the field. Now you can hit X to get rid of it. <laughs> yeah, but sometimes it gives you items or coins. And sometimes the items are good. Sometimes. Let's have a look at that magical map and see what we can learn about that. Whoa, astonishing! This map has way like functions and all sorts of location of a crystal star. Looks like in first call stars, we found a place called Petal Meadows. Petal Meadows? Yes, the area is a fast metal that lies far to the east of our port. East is... White? I think it's white. East white? To tell you the truth, I always thought that place was a test suspicion. The name Petal Meadows did come up from time to time in my research. Okay, fine, so we got there. Does anyone know where to get there or what? I'm fairly certain that some of these cities are piped to You can find out, you get there instantly. Like, pipe travels and fishing. Yeah, it's pretty useful. But by the way, my I'm curious, where'd you get that map anyway? Uh, Peach. From Princess Peach, really? A uh, highness in this, you Maya? I call her highness. This Princess Peach doesn't want to be her, would it? So you can see my text! So it is her! Your princess came to see me the other day, she wanted to learn about the treasure. I told her about the curse of stars and my suspicion about Pearl Meadows. Doesn't seem like it, maybe she tried to go to Pearl Meadows as well. Nah, yeah, she's not smart enough for that. You know, Professor, there was enough suspicious group asking about the same thing. Mm, but I can't imagine Princess Peach getting involved with them. All you have to do is promise her cookies. You know, I want to have to do um, my entire weeks of housework, just because I promised her to. Because I promised her, because I promised her some cookies and a glass of orange juice. Really? Well, I uh, better remember that next time she comes here. Oh, I sell it off the Pell Meadows, you two go. This is Peaches indeed, right now you first priority it must be to catch up to her. Climbing across the stars is me to an end. Now end is Princess Peach. No, no yawning. <laughs> Are you, aren't you coming faster? Oh, come on, I'm like 90 years old. Do you think I'm gonna come around you saving the world? I'm too old for this stuff. Just come see me if you need any old personal advice. Okay, let's leave. And let's get going. I just want my... Uh, I left this hammer in my office. You got the power smash. Hammer, a single hammer using a lot of attack power. Well, let's go out. Uh, take this with you. It's called a badge. It's quite helpful. You see, depending on the badges you have equipped, you get more powerful. I was born this night. But it will be first time you come a badge. No, because that's pretty much simple. No. So you need FP to use that. FP is pretty much a match. F so yeah, you go and get stubborn, you go to badges. We already did this already. Let's put that. And I believe it's now 11.01 p.m. or a.m. in robot time. So, uh, actually, no, I won't go to the best shop just yet. Is there anything important that I'll, I'll check off screen. So anyway, I'll see you guys next time when we go to Petal Meadows. See you guys then.